Okay, I am loving the paint app on this figure. Hey nerds, today we're gonna be boxing this Marvel Legends and Daredevil two pack. Let's get them out of the box. All right, I've been waiting to get this two pack open here. I've been excited to get this one. This Daredevil looks pretty awesome. Let's get these out. Come on, here's one, and here's two. And what do we have in here? More accessories. First up, we have Hydro Man's water effects for his feet. And I'm liking that they each have their own individual design, like water pattern, and they're not just you know copies of each other. That's a pretty nice touch by Hasbro. Don't really expect that from them. Then we have an extra set of hands for Hydro Man, and I'm loving this translucent blue. Let's run through Hydro Man's articulation, and like always, we're gonna start with the feet. They point down that far, up that far. We have an ankle rocker in there. We have double jointed knees, give us a nice bend right there. We have our thigh cut. The legs can kick forward that far. They go out about that far. Don't really go back at all. All right, let's take a look at Hydro Man now. First, we'll get rid of that bag. Look at this figure here. Look at him. I love the translucent blue. Again, saying that again. And I love these little white effects they have like on his chest. It gives him kind of an outline on his hair as well. Not just like only blue. So it does add a nice touch to it to have that little accents there. And as we take a closer look at this head sculpt, I'm definitely liking that they painted his teeth and his eyes and the eyebrows. And that's a really creepy smile they gave him. Pretty cool looking head sculpt. We can spin left and right at the waist. We have ab crunch right here. It bends that far forward, which is not very far at all. That far back. But again, nothing forward. The arms go all the way around at the shoulder. And this joint is really tight here, but it goes out about that far. We spin around at the bicep. We have double jointed elbows. We have our standard wrist articulation. And on the head here, we can spin the head all the way around. He looks down. Let's see, that's a tight joint as well. All the way down that far and then up that far right there. And there's no really left to right lean, but get some nice menacing looks out of them. These feet effects for him just pop right on like this. No big deal, slide in, do the other one real quick like that. And there you have him with his water effects on his feet. Now let's look at Daredevil's accessories, starting with the cable for his batons. Then we have his actual batons. We have two sets of extra hands. We have a second head sculpt. Let's take a look at the actual Daredevil figure now. Get out of this bag. Come on, let's go. Oh, there he is. Okay, I am loving the paint app on this figure. Look at all the little lines in here, little accents amongst the black. That is just so cool. They even painted him on the back. Would have been nice if they hit the back of his head as well on the sides maybe, but they didn't. But still, overall, this is a very beautiful looking figure as far as paint app goes. That is so cool. Let's take a closer look at the head sculpt. I'm loving that facial expression. He looks so angry. That's great. A little bit of black paint running off the mask right there, but not a huge issue. Pretty nice looking head sculpt for Daredevil. Let's run through the articulation on Deadpool and he's on the Renew Your Vows body. So this guy is fully loaded with articulation. Feet go up and down that far. Little toe articulation right there. We have the ankle rockers. We have the calf cut. We have double jointed knees right there. Great bend. We have the thigh cut right there. The legs kick up that far. They go out that far. We have the drop down in there so you can get some even extra range out of them. Very nice on that. These figures have no waist cut, but with ab crunch, bends that far forward and that far back. We have the spin right here at the torso cut. Check that out. It's been all the way around. Great articulation right there. Looking wonderful. We have the shoulders that spin all the way around. We have butterfly joints that go this far forward and this far back. And I think they must have fixed this mold because that wasn't always an issue getting the shoulders to go all the way back. But it just does it all the way on its own. That's pretty awesome. The arms go out this far. They spin right here at the bicep cut. Double jointed elbows, a little bit stiff, which is not always nice though. Look at that, nice bend. And then we have the standard wrist articulation. The head can spin all the way around to the left or the right. Have some really nice left and right lean in there. But then we have the biggest problem that I have with their New Year Vows mold, which is that they don't really look up or down, which is kind of a, a drag. It should really go up farther. We have a cut here that supposedly should let him look up farther, but it just doesn't really work the way they want it to. I think it needs to be wider definitely deeper. I know some people make that mod, but I don't like cutting into the head like that. So you can do that if you want, but you're not really going to get much up and down otherwise. So there you go, nerds. That's the Marvel Legends Daredevil versus Hydro Man 2-pack. Let me know what you think in the comments.